You teach the most important subjects in your school. Originally, if you believe this, when I think about it, when I go to the doctor, I get a physical. My doctor says I need to exercise 30 minutes a day for the rest of my life, right? He didn't say that I need to study science 30 minutes a day, or she didn't say, hey, you need to uh, go over physics 30 minutes a day, but it's saying for the rest of my life, I need to exercise, I need to, to do physical activity 30 minutes a day. So if I gotta do something for the rest of my life, that's probably telling me that's important, right? Then I look at wellness. Well, one thing I realized about wellness is that we're one of the only content areas that you can learn something that day, and it's applicable the moment you walk out of class. So if we talk about decision making, staying away from drugs, okay, as soon as you get out of class, as soon as you get out of school, you might be presented with that. Now I gotta make a decision. We talk about mental health, emotional health. Well, you're dealing with stress and anxiety every day, so when you get these skills in my class, you can walk out and then the next block start to work and apply those skills, right? When the pandemic happened, what they started saying? Don't be at home, go out for a walk, work on your mental health. But now when stuff hit the fan, when we go through a pandemic that we had never been through, now we want to lean back on physical education and wellness, right? And so I want you to know, right, you are important. You are an asset to your school. You're probably the most important teacher, if not the most important, one of the most important, right? And what some teachers don't realize is that the PE practice is harder than most of every, the highest score. I know y'all be sleeping on PE, but you really look at that practice score, it's higher than all the other ones, right? So I, I wanted you to know this. I wanted to do an icebreaker and, and let you know how valuable you are. We already know how valuable we are, but sometimes we need people to speak life into us, and that's what I wanted to do today.